it's lights out and away we go Hamilton and Vettel get away well Bottas very fast ahead of Kimi Raikkonen Vettel on the inside ahead of Valtteri Bottas but for the time being Bottas skips around the outside got a better line into turn two and Valtteri Bottas ahead then of Sebastian Vettel Verstappen is ahead of Kimi Raikkonen Starting from second and fourth on the grid, the Ferraris had a bit of trouble out of the gate running on soft tires. And that opened the door for Max Verstappen, who made quick work of Kimi Raikkonen, going down the outside of the fin on lap three. Next time around the track, Verstappen was at it again, going down the straight into turn one. That aggression has gotten him in trouble before, but here he squeezes through the gap to beat Sebastian Vettel. Check this out, on lap 10, Verstappen in the DRS zone finds the inside line to sweep past Bottas for second place. On laps 19 and 20, the Silver Arrows headed to the pits, giving Verstappen a chance to build up a 9-second lead. That cushion put Verstappen in a great position to pit, where he switched to soft tires. Even after a slow pit stop, the Dutchman was challenging Lewis Hamilton for the lead four laps later, eventually blowing past him in the DRS zone. The fans, well, they loved it, but the Red Bull's success was short-lived. On lap 44, Verstappen spins. Take another look. Bearing down on Esteban Ocon, Verstappen goes in for the pass, but Ocon leaves him no room as he tries to unlap himself, causing the collision. What a idiot! What a idiot! As the race stewards take a look at the incident, Verstappen falls to second place behind Lewis Hamilton. Just behind the leaders, Vettel and Daniel Ricciardo battled it out for fifth place, with the Aussie holding off the Ferrari by a matter of inches through the DRS zone. What a day for him racing through the field. Overall, it was the verstappen ocon collision that made headlines today, but Lewis Hamilton did win the race, and with Valtteri Bottas finishing in fifth, Mercedes took home its fifth consecutive Constructors' Cup. The last team to win five in a row or more, Ferrari from 1999 to 2004. A very strong showing for the Red Bulls finishing second and fourth, and Kimi Raikkonen took home third place for his 12th podium of the year.